This is a quick video to show you how to use uh, LibreOffice Writer. It's a free download. Go search Google for LibreOffice. You can get a copy and install it on your computer. Open up the writer and you'll see a blank screen like this on your page. Uh, I'm going to show you how to do a quick report here. I'm going to center an image that I copied from uh, uh, flamingtext.com and it's just a place where you can get some fancy stuff done so I'm gonna go over here and say insert picture from a file and I'm gonna look over here and find it on my documents and banners and it's called hottechnique.png open that there it puts me a big thing now I can adjust the size of that just by dragging these little handles around and it'll change the, the size of it when I'm done I just come down here to the bottom and I'm gonna go back to left justification I want to use Times New Roman and I'm gonna go with a 14 point type so it makes it a little nicer and uh, one of the best methods I know of to distribute information and it really is doing these free reports and giving them away you can get people's attention and really show them something and uh, make it work real well for you if you want to put the links in it you just come down here and uh, this is where I made the heading I'm going to hold down my shift key and highlight that. I'm going to change it to bold. I'm going to open up this little hyperlink right up at the top with a little world on it and uh, put in the link that I want people to go to. Say it opens up in a new page, apply that and say close. Okay? That makes a tech that makes that a a clickable link when you do the PDF for this. Then I'm going to show you where I'm going to put this when I'm done. Same thing. I'm going to go over here and highlight this. Boop. Notice it's already bold, and I didn't really want that, so I'm going to come up here and click on that thing again, make it so it's not bold. I just want to make this part right here bold. So you see, it's just playing around with it just like you would any other uh, word processor. And I'm going to put the link in there. I'm going to make it open up in a new page. And apply that. And close it. Yep. See what I did? So what I'm going to do is go back and fix it. Here where it says text, I'm going to put in Dropbox because that's what I want it to say. And I'll apply that and close it and that fix it. I can make it bold. So you can see you just keep playing around with it until you get exactly what you want. And then when you're done, you come up here and save it. Just click that little down green arrow there. Save it someplace on your um, computer and we'll call this... Uh, LibreOffice demo and I'm going to save that now it's saved it's ready to go it's a document it's ready to produce all I have to do to make it into a PDF is click on this little PDF thing up here and LibreOffice demo I'm going to save that it's done so now I'm going to take my browser window and make it a little bit smaller so I can work with it and then I'm going to open up my documents and there's my PDF file. So I'm going to squeeze that down a little bit in there or two. So I got two windows side by side. And then I'm going to come up here to the address bar. Brings me into Dropbox. And it's squeezed up. So I'm just going to sign in. There's my uh, login. And 
I want to put this in, uh, let's say, free reports because I'm going to drop it over there. All I have to do is grab the PDF file from my My Documents folder, click on it, and hold the left mouse button, drag it over here, and let it go. There it is. Now, if I want to send that to somebody and show them how to use it, let's open this up bigger so we don't have to keep squeezing this. If you look right over here on the right hand side, the LibreOffice demo, click on this little share a link. And I want to get the link. It's now, link is copied into my clipboard. So if I want to send that to somebody in an email, I would go to Gmail and open it up and paste that in. Uh, just to show you what it looks like. Uh, go back here. click on the link thing up here and I'm going to paste that link in there there's my Dropbox link and let's say I want a blank screen apply and close that's now ready to redo the PDF so I just click on this say I want to save it yes I want to overwrite oops it's, it's still open this is what happens if it's still open so I got to come up here and close this then I can save it as a PDF save yes and then I can go back to my documents and open it again and if I click on this link allow it's gonna open up my browser and show me the PDF on Dropbox if somebody wants to keep that they can click on the download button and download it to their computer or they can put it over to their own Dropbox I mean there's a lot of things you can do with it after that but that's how you write a document save it, export it to a PDF, and load it up to Dropbox. Have some fun with this, and we'll see you online.